Hi! In this video, I'm reviewing GraphQL Bootcamp course from Andrew Mead. I bought this course back in 2018 and never taken the time to watch it. But here we go. I watched it and here is a review. We review the course content, the teacher presentation and the relevancy of this course. Do you get the best GraphQL course if you buy Andrew Mead's course? Subscribe below to make sure you don't miss my videos. The button must be somewhere down here. GraphQL is a popular alternative for RESTful APIs and, in my opinion, way more effective. Let's review the facts first. The course has 4.6 rating from 3.6k students. Andrew Mead teaches the course and he is one of the best teachers on Udemy platform. In the course you learn how to build GraphQL applications using Node.js. You also learn how to use Prisma version 1, then Authentication, Apollo Client and more. You start learning the basics like schemas, queries, mutations and subscriptions. Then you learn how to connect a backend app with a database with Prisma. And you learn about security and authentication. You'll be creating OAuth tokens and validating them. As you advance in creating an app, you'll learn how to implement the data's pagination and sorting. Finally, you'll be deploying your app, learning how to test all the app components. All the content material is presented clearly with enough explanation so everybody can follow along. Andrew Mead teaches so that beginners can follow at a pace that isn't too slow for intermediate learners. The good part is that you are working on a real practical application. The instructor goes into great detail about GraphQL. What I like about his teaching style is his enthusiasm. His tone of speaking will keep you alert and focused. And now the bad part. Andrew is one of the best instructors on Udemy. But unfortunately, this course is quite outdated. Tools like Prisma had major updates and changed a lot. These problems compromise the course advanced topics. The course has lots of incompatibilities and deprecated packages. So you will get a great introduction to GraphQL in the first part of the course, but the rest needs some updates. The last update was in January. What can save this course is that the instructor is very much helpful in the Q&A. You will get your question answered for sure. I would recommend you combine this course with a React course that also uses GraphQL in its content. This course will give you a great introduction to GraphQL. And this is it. So this is what I think. The teaching style is good, especially for beginners. You get the best GraphQL introduction there is. But it uses Prisma version 1, which is outdated. Also some other libraries in the course are outdated, which could make you frustrated. As of today, the course was not updated, but it could happen in the future. So buy this course if you want the basics of GraphQL explained in a super simple way. Also you'll get help if you get stuck at any point. But if you want to work with the latest libraries, then this course is not for you. Unless you see this course was updated sometime after today, okay? Thank you for sticking with me till the end. Have a great day, bye bye!